We begin tonight with a developing story in Balch Springs. Police say a little boy was shot in what they are calling a road rage incident. WFA's Kevin Reese leads us off with what police believe happened and the search for a shooter. The shooting happened in Balch Springs, an incident that police are calling likely a road rage incident. The gunman they are searching for struck two different vehicles and severely injured an eight year old boy. And this is some of that evidence. The bullet holes in that second vehicle. A driver who didn't want to be interviewed, but who told me he was not who the gunman was aiming for. Police say the shots were fired on westbound I-20 between Beltline and Segoville Road. The first car hit driven by a dad with at least three kids inside. He pulled over to call for help when he realized his eight-year-old boy had been hit. We do know that the child was shot right above his hip on the right hand side. The eight year old and two other younger children were taken to Children's Hospital. The eight year old said to be in stable condition. As for the second vehicle also sprayed with bullets, police recovered a bullet from that pierced tailgate and towed the vehicle believing there might be a second slug inside a flattened rear right tire. Important evidence along with shell casings they recovered along I-20 because right now the suspect vehicle description is limited. A dark colored two door sedan with at least two people inside. We're asking for the public's help to see if they have any video or maybe one of the occupants does mention anything about the incident to please call Balk Springs Police Department. Police faced with another difficult road rage investigation with temperatures and tempers flaring on a summer Sunday afternoon. In Balch Springs, I'm Kevin Reese.